In this video, we are going to show you the simple steps to install the Encore 8-channel surveillance DVR kit and how to set up remote viewing from your computer or smartphone. You will need a 3.5-inch SATA hard disk ready to install with the DVR. First, unscrew and slide open the cover of the DVR case. You will see a metal frame inside the case where you install the hard disk. Unscrew and detach the frame. Use the screws that came within the package at the four corners of the frame to attach your hard disk drive. Return the frame back to the DVR case, then replace the screws. Connect the SATA cable and the power cable. Finally, close the DVR case with screws. Before connecting all the devices, make sure the cameras are firmly attached to the surface of your desired locations and wired accordingly. Connect your monitor to the VGA port and the USB mouse to the USB port. You can also connect the DVR to the internet by a LAN cable. Now connect the cameras to the DVR. You will need cables that are long enough to reach between the cameras and the DVR. The power adapter should be the very last cable to plug in. The first time you power on the DVR, the hard disk drive you just installed needs to be formatted. Click Format to continue. After the format is complete, you will be redirected to the default monitoring home screen. Move your cursor to the lower part of the screen to bring up the control bar and click on the main menu icon. On the main menu screen, you'll find various setting options. For example, you can adjust screen color and image position in channel setup, set the recording schedule in record setup, or change language, date, or time in system setup. When you are done with these settings, the exit main menu button will bring you back to the monitor and recording mode. You have two options to watch the recordings remotely on a PC. First, you can install the free software PC Viewer from the Setup CD. Click on the icon PC Viewer Utility Software and follow the on-screen instructions to install the program. Once complete, you'll see a PC Viewer icon on your desktop. Double-click the icon to start. The first time using PC Viewer, You'll have to add the DVR to the program by clicking on Group and then Add. Enter a name for your DVR and its IP address, then your account name and password. If you check the box of the DVR you just added, you'll see the views from the connected cameras. By clicking on the Setting button on the right panel, you can also modify the recording settings. Your second option for remote viewing is to use Internet Explorer. Simply type the IP address assigned to your DVR box into the browser's address field. This address is either assigned by the DHCP server of your LAN network or your Internet service provider in the form of the public IP address. You will be able to adjust the DVR settings and watch the footage as if you are locally connected to the DVR. If the DVR is connected through the Internet with a dynamic IP assigned by your Internet service provider, check out the free services described in our user manual that detect your IP address automatically. You can also monitor remotely from your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad. All you need to do is to download the free application called Secure Viewer from the Apple App Store. Press the Configuration button to set up. On the Configuration screen, enter the IP address, port number, username, and password of the remote surveillance DVR. Use the Stop or Quit button on the left to stop streaming from the remote surveillance system. With other types of smartphones with internet capability, you can type in the assigned IP address to your phone's web browser and watch real-time footage remotely. 
For more information, please go to www.encore-usa.com. Thank you.